Uzi, you ain't Cardi, show not me, never on the scene, what you mean? What is good y'all, it's Trills here coming back at y'all with another video Today I'm going to be reacting to I almost got killed by a weird guy at an empty road by Wansi Entertainment Now if y'all are new, subscribe right now We're at 475 subscribers on the road to 500 subscribers Turn on post notifications, backslap the like button And I'm about to start this reaction in 3, 2, 1 There we go It was winter time and Christmas was approaching. I was 25 years old and I was going to meet up with some of my friends who lived on the other side of the city. It was a four hour drive. This is a different kind of animation. There's a lot more lines from my to place. It. So I decided to take my own car instead of a local cab. It was my first time going alone on such a long drive and I felt nervous <sighs> and excited. Bro, bro, I'm getting goosebumps right now. I don't know if y'all can see that, but I'm getting, I'm pretty sure you can see I'm getting goosebumps, bro. I'm getting goosebumps. I'm not scared of nothing. It's just cold in my room. At midday, I packed my bags, threw them in the trunk, and went off to meet my friends. That it was a cold weird. day, but the roads were clear. I didn't see much traffic as it was the holidays, and people would rather spend time with their families and friends indoors and stay off the roads. Now, I'm not the type of person to go straight to my friend's house. I like to take my time. Mm. I'm a social media freak, and I enjoy posting pictures pretty much all the time. Oh, see, post like this. Go like my picture, guys. <laughs> That's probably how he posts. I mean, look at him. So I bro. found the journey an excellent excuse to post some extra pictures. The road I was taking had beautiful scenery, and the place where my friends lived was even. The scenery would probably look better if it was in real life, because. This scenery looks pretty basic More magical. to me. I stopped a lot during my ride to take pictures. I was having a great time by myself. Well, that was until the weather suddenly changed. It was around 6 p.m. and I was still driving. I still had a long way ahead of me. And that's when it started to snow. Not just a dusting of snow, it was thick and heavy. It don't seem like it. After 15 minutes or so. Oh, <laughs> never mind. Never the roads mind. were already covered with a few feet of snow. I felt anxious Ouch. since it was getting dark and I wasn't even halfway through the drive. My car slowed down and I had to force it to run on the empty roads. Don't the heavy slide snow down. didn't stop. I decided that I would stop at the closest gas station I could find. But unfortunately, I couldn't find one for a while. Ouch. An hour later, I finally saw some lights. Is that a ghost? Look at that Shining white from thing the distance. on the road. It was a gas station. I pressed the accelerator, rushed to the station, parked my car, and went inside quickly. Just as I entered, a strong snowstorm started. The gas. What if it's like a blizzard when he comes out? When he comes out the store, what if the station had a little shop tucked away with some chairs to sit on? The guy at the counter was an ordinary fellow. He didn't really talk much. He He'll look a little weird with that M hairline. He only asked me where I was going in such harsh weather. After that, I bought some chips and drinks and sat down in the furthest chair from him. It was night now. <sighs> I sat, munched on my I must be tired, bro. I keep on yawning for no reason. Food and scrolled through an Instagram. Then, suddenly, the shop's door opened. I looked up at a very I already know this is going to be the guy. This is going to be that guy that causes trouble in these Weird animations. Weird-looking man entered. He had long, greasy hair. What? Bro. You can, bro, you can already tell that he's the guy, bro. He got red hair, he got the M hairline, the Vegeta hairline. Bro, he looks like he's high right now, bro. He was wearing a long coat and had a very grim expression. I saw him buy some cigarettes and he sat down a few chairs away from me. He looked like he do see. He didn't look at me at all. At first, I ignored him, but then he started smoking. 
Since the shop was small and the smoke filled the air quickly, the shopkeeper told him to stop, but he didn't listen. He couldn't oh, ask wow. him to leave because of the storm, so he didn't say anything else. I, on the other hand, hated cigarettes. The weird guy Same. was looking down, breathing very heavily as he smoked. It was as if he was breathing in my ears. So when he took out his fifth cigarette, I lost my temper and angrily told him to stop. He looked... <laughs> Bro, look at his eyes. Don't do that to me. No, no, no. He me for a couple of minutes. His big eyes were red with anger. But then he I smiled and stopped smoking. Uh-uh. Don't do that. No, no, no. No, no, no. His smile was unnerving. You good? I sat down again and distracted myself on my phone. Veins on your neck. Shortly Are you afterwards, good? my friend called me, asking why I hadn't reached their place yet. And I told him the whole story, and he said the storm would soon be over, and I shouldn't worry. When I hung up, I noticed the weird guy staring at my phone with... My God, bro. <laughs> bro, I told you he was on some... I told you he's the guy that's going to cause something bad to happen in this animation. I told you this. I know this. With deep interest. I was afraid that he was thinking of stealing it. Me too, bro. He probably is going to steal your phone. I don't know why you're still there. He's probably going to do something weird. But to my relief, after some time, he got up to leave. At the door, no, he, he stopped, back. looked back, and screamed loudly before Jeez. running away, scaring the crap out of me and the shopkeeper. My heart he didn't return to the that. floor. At 10.30 p.m., the storm ended, and I immediately left after thanking the shopkeeper. I went into my car, driving, started no. it, and drove off. For some... All right, bro. I'm guessing that the, that the story's over, but no, there's always one hit, one, one time thing I at drove the end. in silence, but then I heard a noise. And then, uh -huh. it sounded like heavy breathing. It's him! It's him! <laughs> it's him! My heart rate shot Don't up, be in and my car. hands got all sweaty as the He's breathing the sounded so familiar and so close. Don't. Don't I looked through my rearview mirror and screamed. Jeez. My gosh, bro. Bro, imagine imagine looking in your car thinking that he's not there and then you see you look in the thing and you see him, bro. My heart would have dropped to the floor, bro. The weird guy from lie. the shop was sitting in my back seat, smiling at me. You gotta go. I pressed the brakes go. very hard, got out of the car and mm -hmm. started running. Dude. I felt him running after me too, running. yelling at the top of his lungs. The road was empty, He's running and I felt hopeless as I knew crazy. he was faster than me. I only looked back what? once to see him running like an unnatural being and holding a knife in his hand. <laughs> like an unnatural being, bro. He runs so weird. I increased my pace, still wondering how on earth he got inside my car. How? I might have forgotten to lock the door when I first left to go to the gas station. I but think now, he lost him. Oh, it was mind. too late for regret. My life was dead? at risk because some psychopath was after run. me. Then Don't I saw running. some headlights at a distance. I started him. waving my hands like a maniac, screaming for them to stop. They did, and it turned out to be my friend. He had come to pick me up as he was worried since I was pretty late and thought something went wrong. I looked something back did go wrong. and I saw that guy was gone. Imagine if he would have seen Shankton, bro. Imagine if he would have got him with the knife when he was saying help help and it's uh, uh, uh. I got inside my friend's car and told him everything he called the cops and they arrived shortly after we all went to my car first and noticed some marks made by a knife in the back seat the cops couldn't find the guy anywhere after some investigation they let us leave I drove my car and my friend drove his car back to his place the cops never found the guy and to this day I still wonder what would have happened if my friend didn't turn up that are you s how does he keep finding him all right yo that's the end of the video if you all enjoyed the video subscribe right now we're at 475 subscribers road to 500 subscribers turn on post notifications backslap the like button I'm out peace can I bother can can we tell Mr. Trainer I think I can pull up a water me like I'm dead in your revenge Oh